Welcome to another episode of Challenging Perspectives, where we debate on different topics and just share ideas on like, like various things. So now there's this girl who has been trending. Apparently, it was a show on Bounce and Rounds. For those of you who don't know Bounce and Rounds, it's a show on Kudu Sheldon's channel where they like talk about like different topics. In the course of this show, she was like, she doesn't, she can't date a guy who doesn't drive. So in other words, if you don't have a car or if you don't own a car, she cannot date you. Can you drive me there? What if he doesn't drive? I think a basic requirement hey. for me. For her. For me. I, yes. I just want somebody who drives. Because I don't drive. Okay. If you see you don't drive, and then I, where are we going? So you're going to be talking about it. If someone has money, or if the person doesn't have money, or perhaps the material things the person owns, does it actually matter in a relationship? So I'm going to introduce my guest for today. Is your name? My name is Ellie Kem. Okay. My name is Almas. All right. Okay. So you've seen the video, right? Yeah, I've seen it. Yes. So the girl in question said, if you don't have a car or if you don't drive, in fact, if you don't drive and you don't have a car, she cannot date you. Almas, what do you think about it? Mm, I think car doesn't really matter because it will matter at a point, but it doesn't really matter when you start dating the person. Why do you think it doesn't matter? Because what if the relationship doesn't last long? No, but she's talking about your comfortability, like how comfortable you are. Sometimes you can go somewhere, ordering a ride and everything is like, it's not convenient. So she's saying yeah, that she's been, she has been, she has been doing a lot of rounds, you get it? She goes up and down. So if you don't have a car, it wouldn't be convenient for her. And no one would want to be in like a relationship which is not convenient for you. So she's trying to say if there are other guys who have cars who can drive, then why should she go for someone who doesn't have? <clears throat> so... It actually depends. Like, if you want to take out on a date or something, you can't use Uber. Like, you actually need a car. Oh, so you also agree that when you are going on a date, yes. really? Yeah. You actually have to get the car because you want her to come. You can, you can come and pick it up. Yes, she said. Yes, she also said that if you are going on a date and you come with like a boat, it will be awkward. Yeah, it's actually true. It's actually it true. Depends. It depends. It depends. What do you mean by it depends? It depends on like you know the guy. You know the work he's doing. If he can afford a car, fine. If he can't afford a car, and you know. But do you agree that if you are going on a date with a guy mm -hmm. and, and the guy doesn't drive, he just uses a normal boat or something with like some picanto, normal car? Do you think you don't see a problem with that? Okay, Elikem, what about you? You think um you think she having like she choosing a guy based on he driving or not driving is a problem. But are you okay with it? I'm okay with it. That's mm -hmm. her that's her perception. That's what she feels like. That's what she wants. So you don't have any problem nah, with it? No, I don't it. have any problem Why? with it. Because that's her. Me too, I can choose to go out with a lady who has a car. You see, who has a car, sorry. When it comes to specs, um, my spec can be a fair girl. It can be a tall girl, mm -hmm. a fat girl, so, a, anything. Mm -hmm. But those ones are different. Do you know why? Because those ones are a part of you. If it's a fair girl, if you don't like, if it's a dark girl per se, if you don't bleach, you become fair. You get mm -hmm. it? But this is something that can, if you own a car right now. Mm -hmm. So assuming she's dating a guy, and she gets an ass the guy gets an accident and he loses the car. What is she going to do? No one is up to her. Yeah. No, so I'm saying that right now, she's saying that like she that she not wanting a guy because he doesn't drive. To me, it doesn't make sense. Why? Because once again, listen, assuming she's dating this guy, you have a car, mm -hmm. I mean any nice car, Jane Wagon, Rose Race, or whatever, mm -hmm. and the guy loses the car, it means she's going to break up. So it means the relationship is just based on the car. That is if the guy loses the car. And so that one, she knows the guy had the car. And this is what happened and then. Yeah, so I'm saying that. So it depends. It depends. But I mean, I don't think she's going to break up with the guy. Why would she break had, up? Ah. It would take time for the guy to buy another car. Listen, let me explain. Because the guy had a the, the guy had a car. Imagine before. you have you've saved all your last mm -hmm. to buy a Rolls Royce or mm -hmm. to buy a Honda Civic or any other car. Yes. And you lose it. Do you know how long it will take for you to raise that amount of money? It will take long though, but me, I don't think there is any problem with that too. Me, I see a very big problem with it. Nah. Because first of all, you see, when you when the foundation of your relationship is about something superficial or materialistic, mm -hmm. then if the relationship is not going to work. It's a simple principle. Because you can lose those things. You can be in a situation where you become so broke to the extent that you have to sell your car. You get it. Something can happen to you. Your family member might die. You need to sort out some things, you sell the car. So these things can go like any time, you get it. Mm -hmm. So if you are dating a girl like this, the question you should ask yourself is, if I lose the car, what, where, where is she going to do? And if so I then did, you find another one, another person. If you, who would find another person? You, because that's what she wants. No, but obviously if you are like dating this girl, yeah. Mm -hmm. Who, me? 
anyone, uh-huh. I mean, if if you are dating this girl, mm-hmm. yeah, you know that obviously you are building something. You mm-hmm. spend money on her, so you're you're looking at it for like lifetime. You get it, yeah. So I feel like me like this. Can you date a girl like that? Who wants a car? A guy who has a mm-hmm. car. Me, yeah, I don't have a car, so nah. See, yes, because I feel like if I'm da- if if anyone is dating a girl mm-hmm. and. You just you, you know want something and you can just try it when you're dating this girl and one day just go and pack your car somewhere, tell her that it's missing, and the next three months just tell her that it has been stolen and in the next three months you see she will leave you. So I feel like a relationship like this to me it doesn't make sense. I understand that it's her opinion if she like she can date a, a, whatever she wants. I mean a tall guy. Why doesn't it make sense to you? It doesn't make sense because this is a she she didn't say that is you see. As you are here, if I say choose between a girl who has a Lamborghini and a girl who doesn't have, you obviously choose between because there nah, are options. I mean, hey. Okay, which I will choose? <laughs> I will choose the girl that's <laughs> a Lamborghini. But what if he can't drive, but he doesn't own a car, or like what if he can't drive, but he doesn't own no, a car? No, she someone who owns a car. After driving the yeah, oh, mm-hmm. yes. So, so back to my point. Mm-hmm. You see, right now, if I tell you to choose between maybe a girl who has this and a girl who doesn't have this, you obviously go because there are options. But you have to understand that for a situation like this, she said she cannot date. She didn't say she likes. You get obviously we have our likes, but if you cannot date someone, maybe she has her own reasons. Maybe what with what she does, she's an influencer. She wants to, you know, want to me. So this see. kind of relationship is just like for the short run, for how long you have the car. How? Listen, hey, if, if she's watching this video, I just want to ask her one question. Assuming the guy. The guy loses his car. What is she going to do? And there's no way she can You'll tell me. That way. There's no way she can tell me that she's going to be with the guy. Why? Because if she she can be with the guy, the guy, it means she can be with someone who doesn't have a car. As you mean, you start dating when I have a car, and next you can lose the car. It's the same thing as you being with someone who didn't have the car from the beginning. Sure. You get my point. Hmm. <laughs> I still don't get it. Listen, let me explain it to you. I, you know, you know what me, how I'm seeing the whole thing is. She wants to be with someone who has a car. Maybe she has she has her own reasons. Mm-hmm. I don't know, but then there's that's no what she valid wants. Valid reasons. There's nothing valid. Hey, I feel like you see most of people most of people don't really think about relationship that mm-hmm. way. I feel like they are just looking about how fun is going to be, how convenient. Because she she also said that um, if she's going for a date, yeah, and it's in an Uber, mm-hmm. it's going to be awkward. <laughs> The Uber that people are taking and people are taking and they think that it's expensive and everything. They feel like some people think they are rich because they just use an Uber. That's why there is a saying, cut your coats according to your side. No, just about cutting your coats according to your side. You see, if my spec is, let's say, someone who has like so many things, tall, slim, Kevin, those things are part of you. Mm -hmm. But for a situation where it's subject to change, there is a problem. Do you get it? Because you can be so rich and just lose your money instantly. You get it. So I feel like she's not thinking of it that way. Because there's no way she can tell me that when the guy doesn't have a car, she's going to be with a the person. Then it means you can be with someone if he doesn't have a car. If you are going to date a girl right now, and as you mean, you have a car. Me know the fool, Baba, I don't understand if you have a car. Okay, so as you mean you don't have a car, I don't know if you have a car, but as you mean you have a car, yeah, you hey. drive a Rolls Royce, whatever, and then you meet a girl, you like her and everything. But maybe you didn't know, and you went to see someone told you. You saw a video where she was saying that like she can't date someone who doesn't have a car, but you have a car, and you are in the position to get her. Would you actually go for her upon seeing that video? I'll go for her because because she wants what I have. <laughs> are you serious? Yes. Hey, if she's my spec and she wants what I have, why not? You you don't go for her. No hell no. Hey. Ah, uh, okay, that's you. You see, you know that you are not thinking about the long run. I feel like you are just thinking about the fun you are going to have, the sex you are <laughs> going to have, and everything. But then, <laughs> why are you say? <laughs> no, listen, 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 <laughs> listen. But, if, but wait, what did you say? <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen, like they say, listen, listen. Hey, me and I say I'll go. What is your own? <laughs> <laughs> listen. I feel like no wait answer what is the whole no listen let me explain maybe you're not okay. genuinely be happy yes. with her or something. Let me, uh, let me explain. How you? That is are what you I aware want. that you can lose that car? I, I know. And what if you lose the car? We'll find another way to get one. Which other way? Uh, <laughs> you've used your last money. you use your last money to buy a car. 
And you know, obviously, when you when you lose this car, it will take some time. Do you get it? Unless you are so 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 rich, do you get it? Mm-hmm. It will take some time. Do you get it? And maybe car be a car. Yeah. Money in car, a car. And you might not be able to buy it. Mm-hmm. So you have to understand that there will be a time where you could lose it. Do you get it? Mm-hmm. So you are not going to even consider that you are still going to go for her. I will still go for her if I like her. That is if I like her. I feel like if you think that way, it means you are just thinking about the fun you are, you are going to have with her. That is you. That's how you. No, think. why would you go for her? Because I love I love her, and, and I are like... you looking at it in like the long run? Are you looking at yes. having something serious with you? Yes. And you will, when you are there, you won't be like ah, this girl is because she wanted someone uh, with But the are car. you aware? Maybe it's not only the car that she's even talking about. Oh. No, listen. Whether this, she said ten thousand things, because you see, in the inter- in the in the podcast, mm-hmm. you, we are just talking about the car expert too. No, and she said other things. Yeah, she's talking about. I mean, she's expensive. Like she wants, like oh, you know, it, she's expensive and she doesn't drive. Like hey. she, maybe she wants someone rich. But if she wants someone rich, she should attract who you are. Do you get? It? If you are not rich. I mean, if she's not having a car, how so do you know she's not rich? She doesn't have a car. No, she so, said she's expensive, and I'm saying she doesn't have a car. Do you get it? So if someone doesn't have a car, it means oh, the person is no, 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 rich. No, no. But I'm saying she doesn't have a car. Do you get it? So my. But point, she told you she doesn't have a yeah, car. Yeah, she said it in the video. Okay. Ah, now if she's have, yeah, relax. So I feel like yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so I feel like yeah. If you are dating a girl like this, won't you be scared at a point in time? Me, I won't be scared. See, imagine you are using a Honda Civic. And someone comes with a Rolls Royce. You see, let me give you an example. If your spec is, let's say, a trustworthy woman, yeah, mm-hmm. and there are two girls in question, girl A and girl B, mm-hmm. you get it. And girl A is trustworthy, girl B is more trustworthy. Mm-hmm. It means you are going to be centered towards girl B because she has more of the qualities of your spec. So if you had, if she's also, you know, if the the thing is, if if I have a car and she wants someone who has a car and I like it. And she likes me too. That's okay. I'm very okay with that. You're not going to think that she's going to cheat on you when she, someone comes with a better car, or when you even. It can happen, car. but me to me, I'm trying to. I'm not saying this is not a situation where you want her because of maybe sex or anything. Or like you really you want to start something with her. Yes. Ah, why you were thinking sex all this while, Masa? Why don't I know you? Ah. Oh. Masa, Masa, listen, <laughs> listen. Yo. listen. How? I feel like. If if you're having a car, I feel like you would want to get here. No, bro, nah. Me, those things, it doesn't really matter yeah, to me. It doesn't really matter me. to you. Ah. Listen, I feel like if you are dating this girl and you're looking at like, to the point of even getting married in, mm-hmm. and you know that one of her requirements mm-hmm. for a guy is for you to have a car, mm-hmm. and, you, and whereas you also know that you can lose the car, when you think about it that way, you're going to know that, ah, so imagine I lose the car. You get it. When you think about it, that's when you're going to realize that, no, then she will leave me. Because, mind you, when you lose the car, it doesn't mean Kojo in Amasame has lost his car. He also <laughs> has his car. It doesn't mean someone is still going to... Everyone, everyone also has their car. You get it. So the point where you lose it, that's when the other people are like, you get it. it's a jackpot for them. You get it. And those were her requirements. You get it. And if something is a requirement, it means that's what you need to like. So, yeah. Hmm. We bring now our I miss to our go for it. <laughs> you still go for it. Yeah. Hmm. Do you think would you go for someone who has a car? Yeah, assuming okay, you I know you're a DB, but assuming you're no. a oh. DB. Oh. No. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Your name. What's the, the, the name? The name again. Almas. Almas. Yeah. Assuming you have a car, yeah. Do you drive? Not like on the road, like that. Do you drive where? No, drive here. Small, 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 small errands and things, but like not like long distance okay so yeah assuming like you drive like on a regular yeah and you meet a guy the guy's like he wants a db he wants someone who drives can you be with him no why am i your driver no 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 listen 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 yeah, you put the question you said like what put the question. assuming you meet a guy mm-hmm. and you get to know that his spec is a girl who drives a girl who drives mm-hmm. yeah who owns a car and who drives do you get mm-hmm. it can you be with him no, because I feel like he's b- he's with me just for what I have. It actually depends on ah, how yeah, exactly. you guys putting you you know they think about the future. Exactly, it's like maybe if I if I lose the car, he can't leave me exactly. because I'm his spec, and now I have I've lost what he wants. Yeah. You, you, yeah, I don't know for you. Sir. I don't know what his squad is. I don't know. I don't know the mindset no, his squad gets. Can, but I feel like. You feel like listen, <laughs> listen, hey. listen, listen. I feel like. Uh-huh. <laughs> The girl, this is how I see it. I feel like you've seen the girl. 
know her. Uh-huh, I know her doesn't mean listen, that. Let, listen, let me land. No, let me land. you see this listen. where you're getting. No, no, let, let me okay, land. land. I feel like you've seen that girl. You've seen her before, like in real life. Yes. She's attractive for you. I've been seeing the picture she has been posting. Very attractive. Did I say she's attractive for me? No, Why let's see. Let me finish. Yeah, okay, talk. Ah. Let me finish. Uh-huh. You've seen the. I've been seeing a lot of pictures with her in the beginning. And I saw that. I feel like you feel so attracted to it. So you're not even thinking about the point <laughs> where you lose it. So you're, you're like, oh, in the six months, car, even if I get it. At least I'm um, chopping. Yeah, 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 yeah. At least I will get <laughs> Hey, to why are you guys thinking for me? Hey, <laughs> no, no, no. You, I know ah, you. I know. But wait, why, why are you thinking for me? Uh, because I know you. You and, know me. And you, you, from me, me. you know me. And from, even from what you are saying, it's it's it connects the dots. I feel like you are thinking that, like, I mean, if I get the car, me, you know what I'm saying. That I feel like that's her opinion about her. She she wants to roll roll with someone who has a car. Maybe it depends on. The, the business she runs and all that do you understand maybe of uber time yeah if you are her boyfriend you, she doesn't want like you to you know that's why in the beginning and you see when she said um they did something you can't pick a date to uber or something mm. what she said you said it to be awkward hey, yeah she didn't say she doesn't like she said it to be awkward she like, like our team as well yeah yeah she feels like charlie where she sees herself her standard and things won't mean for both in my family. Stand, which standard is that? Which standard is that they're saying? That's her brand. That's her. That's her. And that's how she wants to be treated. What is your own? Maybe someone else to prefer a guy. No, if if I feel like yeah, if you want that kind of treatment, then mm-hmm. you should actually have a car. You get it. You, you don't have, have to. Hey, no, nah, it is my treatment. It is a guy that wants me. And hey, now if I'm there, and then no, you. But obvious, so you don't want the guy. No, you I'm trying. You, you don't you let it look guy, as if oh, it's the guy that wants you. You the guy, you are the one approaching her, right? Mm-hmm. And she said, okay, fine, you have to have a car before you come to her. What is your own? No, the, listen, listen. When it comes to relationship, when it comes to your spec, When it comes to relationship, when it comes to now, your spec, uh-huh. If there are some things where you can't, if I tell you I like you, if, uh, sorry, if I hey, you like me, they <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, if, then I hear no. <laughs> let's see, Alma tells you that she likes you. Yeah. Alma, do you like me? Let's go, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> if a girl tells you that she likes you, mm-hmm. yeah, and then she's and you ask her why she says that you're you dark or you're intelligent or you're smart, those things are a part of you. You develop them. They don't change over time. Do you get it? But then if I tell you I like you for, because of your car, those things can it can go anytime. You can get an accident. Why would you think you are not to get an accident? It's, it looks so ambiguous, but then trust uh, Before me. that, I know you had a car and this is the reason why you lost your car. So why would it move me? So if you can be with me when I when I lose my car, then you can be with someone who doesn't have a car from the beginning. But so that is what she wants. She wants someone who has a car. What is yours? And what if you lose the car? And yeah, no, I don't know. Then we find another way of getting the car. And what if you have listen, listen. You there, who the end? Listen, what if and what if you are having three hundred thousand cities? That's the money you have right uh-huh. now. You use two hundred and fifty thousand cities. And then three hundred thousand Ghana cities. Me relax, and you. Relax. It will take it will, it will take, time. take like five years. You are trying to say for the four years she'll be with you. Where well, she can go for another guy with a car. You why have to, you, you, why have, you, why you have to understand something. At the point where you lose your car, other people still have DS. So it's not like they've also got an accident. So they also have DS. And obviously she's attractive. I mean, depending on how you see her, but then she's attractive. To you. To you, she's attractive. No, she's <laughs> at, no, I'm asking you. Um I don't have like a visual image of her right now. I can't really re- let me no, show no, 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 relax, relax. Let relax. me show you. What are you going to show me? Okay. You, yeah, she's attractive. She's attractive. Uh-huh. I mean, yeah, for the sake of time, she's attractive. Mm-hmm. So I feel like, what was I even saying? <laughs> so I feel like, yeah, for someone like this, you have to understand that when. <laughs> Mom. I mean, how is it's however you see him. I mean, so I feel like when you lose your car at that point people still have DS. do you get it okay so i feel like yeah for something like that it is materialistic it is superficial and you can lose it at any time so if you're dating someone like that then you should drive better than paul walker you should you should make sure that Mm. no matter what you are you don't get an accident you should like be able to like keep your car very well if it's in the whatever you need to keep it very well that's the only way you get it and even with that one, so if someone will have a better car, you can't be the richest person. Over time, someone will overtake you. And if that person who is richer than you likes it, imagine what, oh, you them not go see yourself. So I feel like, yeah, but then guys, let me know what you guys think in the relax, comment section. Relax. Oh, talk. No, you talk. Like the, the way you are talking, relax. I, oh, I just talk fast. 
Yes, yeah, so that's all for today. If you like this, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. And I'll see you in the next video.